Hello everyone, welcome to Manmaker. I am Ranjan Kumar and today we are going to talk about uh, that uh, trainee exam, uh, trainee engineer, BL trainee engineer exam happened uh, on uh, 25th and 26th October for TEBZ and TEEM. So for all the brands like electronics, mechanical, electrical and computer. Now uh, OMR based exam over. Now what is the next round? What uh, next step you need to do and what uh, what is the expected cut up and uh, when they are going to announce the result everything we are going to discuss okay before also i told you same thing uh, when we started class this thing uh, uh, before also i told you about selection process and all there are two step is there only first is your written test that you have done with written test and the second one is the DV. DV means document verification. There is no interview, nothing. Uh, now, directly you will get result. And uh, after that, uh, they will give you date for the document verification. And uh, you have to go with all the document and uh, your joining will be over. This is the process for the trainee engineer. Okay. As you know, this is OMR based exam. This was happened OMR based exam and I know you got that OMR carbon copy also. But uh, there is no use of that one because they are not going to release any key answer. Uh, as it is OMR based, so no key answer, nothing they are going to publish. Directly they will give whether you have selected or not selected. Like that mail will come in your mail or uh, it will publish in the website. Uh, that selected candidate list it will published in the website or those who haven't selected they will get mail or message like you haven't uh, you did not get qualified in the written exam like that they will mention okay so uh, here uh, result you can expect uh, accept uh, expect for this thing generally bl uh, whenever bl is conducting any exam so generally minimum he will he, uh, it will take 40 days okay 40 day it will take to uh, publish their result and all so uh, 25th and 26th october exam over i mean happened so most probably you can expect your uh, result in the december first week or mid of december okay mid of december you are going to expect your uh, result and uh, you will directly get mail or uh, it will publish in the website okay and uh, after publishing of that uh, result 15 day till 15 day time is there 15 to 20 day time is there for document you need to arrange all the documents whatever they will um, tell you uh, means first they will publish the result list of uh, candidate who got selected in the website after two three or four day you will get a personal mail there they will uh, give you a list of document that you need to carry at the time of document verification like uh, medical test police verification and lic all the things they will uh, mention there so after uh, 20 days uh, maximum 20 days they will give time for before joining you need to arrange all the these things so then uh, they will give you one date in that date you need to go for document verification and after that your joining is over this is the process for this training engineer okay and uh, cut up as i got messages after the exam uh, this paper was easy only and uh, they uh, so many uh, people got good mark they have uh, they told uh, so many people message like they got uh, they have corrected they have attempted good and all so based on all that uh, marks and all uh, uh, here you can see some expected cut up first we'll talk about electronics so for electronics it is like for your category you can expect your it will be go 55 ever or 57 it will go okay after 57 your cut up will be 57 and above like that it will go uh, general category for OBC it will be 55 for AWS it will be 53 SC it will be 50 and ST it will be 48 maybe it will vary plus and minus two or three number it will go but your expected will be like this if you have attempted like for general category i am saying if you are feeling like 55 plus you are getting in a electronic branch then you are in a safe zone okay now for mechanical mechanical people like uh, uh, same for general it is 60 60 and above it will go obc 57 ews 55 sc um, uh, 52 and st is 50 like that you can expect your uh, cut up 
okay and for computer it will be 56 for general category obc it will be 55 EWS it will be 53, SC it will be 50, ST it will be 47, okay. And for electrical it will be 55, OBC 60, uh, 53, EWS 51, SC 47 and ST 45. So you know total 610 uh, vacancy was there. So your cutoff will be like this only, based on this only you are going to get select, okay. For general category, either you are from any branch, if you are filling, like you are getting 55 plus or uh, for mechanical, it will be 60. So 55 plus, it will be your good marks. Okay. For and other branch like that, uh, as or other uh, category, your, uh, you can check how much you are getting and uh, you do one thing, just go to comment section, comment your marks with your branch. So you will just tell your uh, marks with other people also and you will come to also know like this you will get the cut up and one more thing i am just going to tell you they are not going to release any cut up marks and all they will directly give the selection list only okay and you will uh, maybe you don't uh, you will not get your marks how much you are getting like that things are there in the training engineer course so i am just uh, giving this the uh, like what cut up they will uh, they are going to select for the merit list based on that only i am displaying this thing okay don't expect that they are going to give you other cut up marks like for electronics this is a cut up marks and we are going to select based on this only they will directly publish the list of the candidate all right so time is there till 40 day it is there so meanwhile bl provisionary exam notification came that is a permanent basis uh, job is there this training engineer is a temporary as i told you before also but that provisionary is the permanent if you have age age in that uh, if you can apply just go and apply you all are eligible for uh, apply for that uh, so many people are uh, asking in a message like i have uh, applied for trainee engineer i gave trainee engineer exam uh, whether i have uh, i am eligible for provisionary or not so you are eligible you can apply and prepare for that classes is very soon it is also going to start so just be focused that is a permanent post and uh, if you do hard work you will get selected like here you got the good marks so like that i will guide you you will get the good marks in the provisionary engineer also one more thing one trainee engineer post again uh, they have released recently that is uh, for hls department okay and uh, those who have applied that one also and if you are preparing uh, with this trainee engineer material which i provided to you so i am just telling you that hls department uh, syllabus is different that i will show you tomorrow okay uh, next video i will discuss that one for all the branch material is same for the HLS department in last time also I told you this time also they are going to uh, means focus only that uh, slavers only okay so basically I am just going to tell you uh, like uh, you have 40 days time to um, getting your result and all meanwhile you just go and do comment in your uh, in the comment how much how was your exam and uh, how much marks you are expecting from yourself and apply for provisionary engineer okay so that's all for today all right this many doubt you have so i clear today apart from that anything is there just do comment i will see that one okay okay so that's all for today thank you